In this video let us see the basic definitions in DC circuits. Independent voltage source. If the voltage of a source is constant, and will not depend on any parameters of the circuit, it is called an independent voltage source. Resistance. The property of the material due to which it opposes, or restricts the flow of current through it is called resistance. Resistivity. It is the resistance per unit length, and cross-sectional area. Electric current. The rate at which the electric charge is transferred across a point in a conductor is known as, the current flowing through the conductor. The ampere. One ampere of current is defined as that current which, when flowing through a resistance of 1 ohm, causes a potential difference of 1 volt across it. The electric potential. The electrical potential at any point in a charged conductor is defined as, the work done to bring a unit positive charge from infinity to that point. The potential difference. The potential difference between any two points of a charged conductor is the amount of work that has to be done to bring a unit positive charge from the point of lower potential, to the point of higher potential. EMF, electromotive force, of a source. EMF is the force that causes an electric current to flow in an electric circuit while the potential difference between two points in an electric circuit is the difference in their electrical state which tends to cause flow of electric current between them. Volt. 1 volt is defined as, the potential difference across a resistance of 1 ohm, through which a current of 1 ampere is flowing. Ohm's law. It states that, temperature remaining constant, the current through a passive element is directly proportional to the voltage across the element. Series circuit. The series circuit, in which resistances are connected end to end, so that there is only one path for current flow, is called series circuit. Parallel circuits. When a number of resistors are connected in such a way that one end of each of them is joined to a common point, and the other end of each of them is joined to another common point, then the resistors are said to be connected in parallel and such circuits are known as parallel circuits. Kirchhoff's current law. In any network of wires carrying currents, the sum of incoming currents towards any point is equal to the sum of outgoing currents away from that point. Or, in any network of wires carrying currents, the algebraic sum of all currents meeting at a point is zero. Kirchhoff's voltage law. In any closed circuit or mesh, the algebraic sum of voltage drops plus the algebraic sum of all the EMFs in that circuit is zero. Electrical work. In an electrical circuit, there is movement of electrons which constitutes flow of current. This movement of electrons results in transfer of charge. Electrical power. The rate at which electrical work is done in an electrical circuit is called electrical power. Electrical energy. The total amount of electrical work done in an electrical circuit is called electrical energy. Thank you, and please don't forget to like, share and subscribe Rough Book.